Wow, we're actually really impressed. We thought we were going to have to get like pictures of mojitos to get anybody to come here. <laughs> so, <laughs> well, apparently there's no internet connection because we were going to get pictures of pictures of mojitos in the absence of actual pictures of mojitos. So, you know, and sorry, there's no more receptions either, so you're on your own. <laughs> the local uh, bar is probably happy that we're implanting these thoughts in your head. So what we're going to talk about today is technology and how to find and fit the right technology to your needs. And you are going to, first we're going to have two case studies, um, just very briefly some ideas and principles to keep in mind. And um, you know, one of the classics about form following function, and you could kind of combine this with the next point. The whole point about technology is it doesn't exist for its own sake. It exists for the purpose of fulfilling a customer need or a business need, there's a reason that it exists. And it's by that reason that one can start to judge whether you've got a good fit or not. And as silly and as basic as that might sound, it's surprising how many people find a technology and then try to figure out where they can use it. Um, which is sometimes leads to serendipitous discovery, but more often, especially in certain more operational cases, leads to disaster or expense or heartbreak and frustration. Um, and it's always a balancing act. Uh, you cannot get, always get what you want. You can't get everything that you want ever. So there's trade-offs. And today, what we're going to hopefully talk about is how two organizations have dealt with some of these trade-offs and how they've found appropriate technologies for certain needs. And then we're going to have a uh, talk about, you know, what are the questions? What are the things you really should be asking yourself when you're trying to see if you are um, going down the right path? So without further ado, I'm going to figure out how to change these slides and the lovely Mr. Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> is going to come up here. There you go. You're all set.